Race 40 is the Westy Stakes, a 1 mile 2, 0 to 100 for 3 year olds and up. Vanquish for Joshua Southern, early starter for D French, Stormy Willow for C Beckwith, Hannah and Jeans for Vinnie Gerard, Alessandro Durr for James Shea, Graphic Spoken for David Ladd, Total Break for Mark Jones, Rududu Irish for T Rogers, Bunrathy Span for David Ladd, Carol Sally for Steve Brown, Terminator for Paul O'Neill, Tidy Bay for Mark Jones, Always Dreaming for Dan Hughes, Star Queen for Nick Driver, Lipu Crest for Vinnie Gerard, Da Vinci for D French, Green Holiday for Steve Brown, Sheer Moss and Dove Cottage for Alex Cherry, and that's Miguel and Thornton Piccolo for our Costello. 21 go to post in the Westy Stakes. You don't want to be drawn outside here, it could be a bit of a struggle. As they're off in and quite a nice line, but they're on the bend already, and as you can see, the ones on the rail are making the best of their way forward with Vanquish, Da Vinci. Hannon Jeans has got across from a middle draw, and it's Da Vinci from Vanquish, Hannon Jeans, these three in a line. In behind them is early starter with Terminator on the rail. Fawns and Piccolo is also there. Out wide is Bunratty Span. But it is the three in front. Vanquish just noses in front from Da Vinci on the rail. Hannon Jeans. Early starter is there in fourth. Terminator, Carol Sally, both there, always dreaming. Graphic Spoken, Tidy Bay, Bunratty Span on the outside. Star Queen is also there. In the middle of those is Dove Cottage. Sheer Moss down the outside. On the rail is. Um, not sure who that is in the round, the blue and white. Stormy Willow in the middle, we've got Total Break. Um, Grin Holiday is also there in the middle with uh, That's Miguel. And then Leepu Crest and Fawns and Piccolo are at the back. And it is Vanquish still in front by about a nose from Da Vinci. Hannon Jeans is in third. Tidy Bay is making some ground now for Mark Jones. Uh, Star Queen and Hannon Jeans are also trying to get going. Always Dreaming, Carol Sally, Stormy Willow. They're all starting to make a run for home. And it's Vanquish in front. And Vanquish is in front for Joshua Sutherland with Da Vinci tidy base. Star Queen making a move now. But it might be too early as they're only just into the final three. And it's Star Queen who's dropping away now again from Vanquish, Da Vinci. These two back at it on the rail. Down the near side, we've got Bunratty Span, Stormy Willow in the middle making a charge home. It's still Da Vinci on the rail. Still Da Vinci, here's Terminator for Paul O'Neill. Coming through the gaps into the final furlong. And it's Da Vinci and Terminator. And Terminator hits the front from Da Vinci, an early starter. And they're coming back now. And it's Da Vinci again on the rail. Terminator is neck and neck. It's nose to nose. It's a photo. As Derek Thompson would exclaim, that is a photo. No idea there. That's one of the closest ones I've seen in a long time. Da Vinci gets back up on the rail. Terminator's run just couldn't keep him there as Da Vinci. We got to the front for Dan French and wins well. Off 65. Terminator was second for Paul O'Neill. Early starter was third for Dan French. If you look at some of the draws there, I think the first five drawn might have been the first five home. So, well, apart from Forte Piccolo, who was drawn three, but I think draws one to six, I think five of them may have produced the top five. There you go, five, one, two, six, four. That says it all here at Newcastle, but take nothing away from Da Vinci.